Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back on Rise of the Tomb Raider. Uh, let's continue. I need to dive into the water here. And let's get this show on the road. What do I need to do? Ah, yeah, over here. Have to remember where to go. It's been... Got to find a way to get up higher. Maybe I can raise the water. Okay, let's open this wall. I played this, like, right when it came out. Uh, so I don't remember all that much about it. Because, you know, when you end up playing just a ton of games, eventually you just forget what some games... This puzzle is easy, but... And I remember this puzzle because it's that easy. But, like I'm saying later in the game, you know, some of those puzzles I probably won't remember. Okay, I need to pull that down. There we go, it breaks. And where is... Okay, never mind. I thought there was another... Uh, what's it called? Flat that I needed to drop. It's not the proper term. What's it called? Pallet. There we go. Pallet. thought there was another pallet I had to use to get up, but I was wrong. Okay, so there's this hole there. Damn, they're almost inside. My lord, what you say is impossible. I myself drove a spear into the Prophet's heart. I saw him die. Doubtless, his people have propped another man up in the slain Prophet's robe to continue his lies. They are broken, discredited, and exiled. We will head south and put the rest of his people to the sword. But the Prophet is dead. This, I swear. Okay, so the first one before that I we listened to, that was about the Prophet, not about Trinity. Hold on. Let me go ahead and drop down here. I see some stuff over here. Open that cash up. My lord, I ride at the head of a small army of the faithful, armed and ready. And I have good news. We have located the tomb of the Prophet. We were attacked by madmen upon the road, wearing the Prophet's livery. But they were easily bested. We allowed one to flee, and followed him back to the Oasis. Whether the Prophet escaped death, or whether another now wears his mantle, it does not matter. All will perish inside. And it will become a tomb at last. Alright, now we can continue unless there anything up here. Whoa, this has like a whole area around here. Never knew this. Oh, more coins. I never knew that this existed back here. If only I would have paid more attention. Um, so that's how I think it wants you to get back up. But I think you can get up over here. Oh, no you can't. You gotta use this jump. Alright, let's do it. Alright, and away we go. So one thing I don't like about this game, some of the jumps, it feels like you hang at certain spots when you really should probably fall. Alright, let's continue. There we go. I done goofed. I jumped over that too early, and then when I tried to jump over that one, I landed right on it. All right, here is the pallet uh, puzzle that I was thinking My of. My lord, the last remnant of the Prophet's followers have barricaded themselves inside his tomb. We have made camp at the entrance, and we are preparing to break through their barricades. I saw the man claiming to be the Prophet before they sealed the gates, and I admit, he bears a striking resemblance. But it could not be. 
no matter. They will all be dead before sunrise. The Order of Trinity will see that his heresy ends here. Alright. So language proficiency, Greek was increased to level 2. Then jump here, jump over here. Also need to shoot that down. Break through this wall. Wait, it wants me to... Oh, I have to hit it again. I was like, I thought I had it, but I guess it didn't. Okay, so... Okay, now I want to go here. Get blown off. Okay, hop onto this. Getting a running start. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on, I, I got this. Which side of that do I want to... Oh, okay, I admit, okay. I'm stupid. I got it now. Okay, jump onto this. Get blown off. Hop onto this. Then hop onto this. There we go. Thought you jumped on that middle pylon. I was wrong. Now you jump onto this. And voila! And we're here! Found you. <laughs> empty. It's empty. No! No! What did I miss? Hey, it's down here! Set the charges! Its tomb. After all this time. And the artifact? Inside, God willing. Open it. Carefully. It could be extremely dangerous. Hell are you? You're a smart woman. I suspect you already know. Trinity. Where is the artifact? I don't know what you're talking about. Don't play games with me. You led us to this place. Look, it was empty when I got here. There was no body and definitely no artifact. Let's go. I thought I had to shoot that guy. I was in like mid jump trying to aim. Kill that guy. Wait, 
one of the- oh, there it is. There it is. I think you can- no, I don't think you can. There's one jump that I forget which one it is. You can avoid a section if you make it. There. Almost there. Oh crap! Oh crap! I gotta re get a running start. <laughs> that was so less epic than it's supposed to be. Laura. There's so much I need to tell you, I don't... Did you find the Prophet's tomb? Yes, but I was followed. What? By who? They call themselves Trinity. They tried to kill me. What the hell is going on here? You're starting to scare me. The tomb was empty, but I think they were looking for the Divine Source. The, the artifact your father was after? There's more. I found this symbol in the tomb. I knew I'd seen it before. It was driving me insane. That's when it hit me. I saw it here, in one of Dad's books. Listen to this. The lost city of Katesh, said to have disappeared in Siberia sometime in the 12th century. Legend says that on the eve of the invasion by the Mongol horde, it sunk beneath a lake. What does this have to do with the Prophet's artifact? The same symbol. <laughs> Laura. <laughs> if the divine source is hidden in the ruins of Katesh, waiting to be found, then I have to go. To Siberia? Are you kidding me? Just think. If this thing could really unlock the secret of immortality, it would... It would change everything. Sickness, suffering, death, gone. Are you listening to yourself? Jonah, we've been through so much together. You know there's more out there. This could be real. I don't care if it's real. I've lost too many friends. I don't want to lose you too. Dad never made the connection to Katash. He gave up everything for this. Including you. Stop blaming yourself for what happened. He made his own bed. I can't give up on him. Not now. It's all I have. No, it isn't! If you stayed still for five minutes, maybe you'd see that. Damn it! Jonah? Stop us! <sighs> Shit, Laura. What are we gonna do? I led them to it, Jonah. If the divine source is real, we've got to find it first. Siberia it is, then.
I don't know why. I would have just have shot him. I don't think I would have given him the chance to run. Just put him down. to find me. I need to do this alone. Got to find shelter. Okay, so now we need to find a place to take shelter as we stumble and bump my controller. <laughs> my controller was disconnected, that's so why I didn't move immediately. Somehow it's wired, but for some reason it like turned off. But let's make our way through the snow, this freezing cold snow. Keep moving. I feel like I can move faster through Come the snow on. than this. You can do this. Move. I'd definitely just be rolling down this hill. An old camp. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Got to start a fire. <sighs> Alright, let's go gather some wood. See, I feel like if I was freezing cold, okay. I would wanna. That's my work. I would wanna run. Not enough to last the night. Um, need to gather more. Dry enough to burn. I hope. Okay, now here's the deer. Fresh kill. No meat. Oh shit, we've got wolves. Back to camp. Wonder if you go back down there and explore what happens. I bet it just Damn won't it. let you. Or like a sloth. We'll get there in like 10 years. I wish this pain wasn't so familiar. Like looking an old enemy in the eye. It wants to take me down. It wants me to just lie down and die. But I won't. I can't. There's something here. There must be, or Trinity wouldn't be in this snowy hell. I just hope that Jonah is okay. That he found a way back. I... I just couldn't risk having him with me. Not again. The pain of losing him, that would be too much to bear. This is my path, and mine alone. 
Going okay, alternate. All right, alternate outfits. Change Laura's attire to best suit her adventure. Multiple outfits are available and are unlocked by progressing through the game and completing certain missions. Some outfits give gameplay benefits when worn. Switch outfits at the base camps by accessing the weapons menu and browsing the category clo cat clothing category using LB and RB. All right, so we can't upgrade this bow. Reinforced limbs, that increases damage. Gonna go ahead and do that. And now, alternate outfits. Let's see here. So we got whiteout jacket. What does this look like? I prefer the whiteout opposed to the expedition, I think. Okay, so we're, 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 we're rolling whiteout so far. Leather jacket is what I wore before. These are all craftable things that I obviously don't have enough to craft. Otherwise, I'd probably wear the Immortal Guardian. Eh, Siberian Ranger? What does this look like? Eh. The leather jacket is my favorite, but I feel like I wear it way too much. So let's go, let's go with the whiteout jacket for now. Maybe I'll switch to the leather jacket later. Okay, skills. So we got a new skill point. Uh, let me check Brawler. Thick skinned, iron hide, capacitate. Okay. Enemies killed while in stealth will be on. I want that one. That's the first one I want. The efficient killer. Okay, let's see what we need to do now. All right, so we need to explore the forest for signs of the lost uh, city. I think I'm going to cut the episode here, and we will pick this up in uh, the next episode. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch you guys then. Peace out.